Hello everyone, day 31 here, it's Harry uh, and we're talking um, about refreshing change. I think that's how we'll, we'll dub it today. So for those of you who've been following, uh, I'm doing 100 days to a happier, healthier uh, and more successful lifestyle. This is day 31. The weather here is miserable today. Um, I don't know whether you can uh, get that from the background, but it's certainly uh, wet and horrible. You might hear this dripping here that's coming down by the side of the door. Um, and I thought, because to be fair, we've not had weather uh, quite like this for, for a little while, um, I wanted to, or it reminded me, it made me mindful of um, just how important it can be to to kind of rinse ourselves off, essentially. Not like, you know, literally, but yes, literally, you know, have a shower, you stink. <laughs> but, um, it, you know, with respect to, to change and allowing things to sort of wash over. So what I mean by this, metaphorically speaking, is that sometimes we can be doing something and um, you know, a particular task or an activity, a job, whatever it is, maybe at work, in business, where we are really, really pushing to get to an end, but actually, it's kind of like flogging a dead horse, as the saying goes. And so that builds up with frustration and it doesn't necessarily make the progress that you want and then it becomes a vicious circle and and really what ends up happening is, is we just become so fed up and so frustrated that actually it starts having an impact on our on our lives, you know, on other parts of our lives. So with this weather in mind, the point really that I'm, I'm wanting to make is that Actually, sometimes what we need to do is we need to just step back from that and we need to allow that sort of refreshing change to come over. We need to allow time for the bad weather to pass, the storm to pass, you know, however you want to interpret that, you know, and with the rain, uh, let things wash away. Um, so whatever that particular task is, the job is, you know, if you come away from that and, and give it some time, let the bad weather pass so that when the sun comes out again, i.e. when you come back to it another time, you're fresher, you're brighter, um, you're more motivated. And actually what you can what you can tend to find is that um, you, you've got the answer that you needed. You know, whatever it was that was, um, you know, escaping you when the weather was bad, um, by the time that wet weather has passed, you've got the answer that you need. You can crack on and finish the job. The sun is shining. Let's make hay and all of these other different <laughs> analogies and things. Anyway, that is it from me because I'm getting increasingly wet. So I'm going back indoors uh, and I'm going to crack on with more of what I'm working on. Hope you're all well. See you tomorrow. Take care now. Bye bye.